Hey, I'm Dan Brown. And this is Project Toasty. So you almost ready to go? Yeah, I'm just putting on my shoes and then I have to grab the GPS. No need. I got our map right here. That's a drawing that you made 10 minutes ago. Still accurate. Well, how are we going to know when we're supposed to turn? Well, when we stop seeing garbage mountains and we start seeing girls in trucker hats with bikinis on, then we know we're at the Jersey Shore. Where do you get your information from? Experience, my friend. Experience. You're not my friend. You're just my ride. Remember what you said later on. Right. I did not mean it like that, and you know I didn't mean it like that. You said it, not me. Hi! So, have any of you guys been obsessing over the world according to maps on Tumblr? Yeah, me neither. Actually, I'm just kidding. I love them! And here is mine. It's actually not of the world, but it is of the tri-state area, and I didn't even know Connecticut was a part of that until last year, so I didn't even include it in my map. Yeah, I think it's both really accurate and really one-sided, which I just poked myself in the face, which makes it really funny. And since we haven't done a drawing challenge in a while, you guessed it this week's project challenge! You are going to draw a map of the world according to you. And don't pretend that you know something when you don't, that takes away all the fun. For example, Antarctica, all that it is to me is where the penguins live because everybody knows that I'm obsessed with little penguins. Here are some examples that I found on Tumblr of how the United States views the rest of the world. You can make yours super simple like mine or you can make it as intricate as you like. And don't worry about stereotyping, I mean that's kind of the entire point of this project. That's what makes it really funny. I mean it's pretty impossible to know exactly what it's like to live somewhere if you've never lived there or anywhere even remotely close. I just have always thought how amazing it is, how many different people there are in the world, and how every single person has a different life. And of course, when you are done with your project, post it to the Project Toasty Facebook page. That's where all of us Toasties will get together and comment. And other than that, we will see you guys on Facebook and Twitter and back here on this channel with a brand new episode next Toasty Thursday, and I will see you guys then. Bye!